this is where the tenants have brought down their bottle segregator to us, their batteries, some of more of their electronic components. This is how we expect the tenants to bring the waste down to us. We expect it in clear plastic bags so that we can inspect and all the product the same. We'll have a, that's it, standard bags. And we will take these then, we'll take these then here and we'll put them into these two balers here. This is just for plastic only. We can change that around. But the following one there, we just have plastic bottles in this one here ready to go. We just started bailing them. If you look then, following around by my hand then, we have tin cans getting ready to be done. More plastic bottles, hangers, magazines, and hard plastic. At the moment, we're doing about 35 tonnes of waste a week at the moment, between everything, excluding recycling, just from pure waste. Now our recycling for the first quarter to date now is up about 13% against the same time last year. We get a lot of people into visitors, they come to see what we've done. It seemed to be best practice, but there's always things to learn. We've gone to all other Hammerson sites, we've seen things that we haven't thought about recycling. You get to other sites, you see other processes, and a smarter and better way of doing things. There's always room for improvement, no matter where we are. Annually, we uh, visit all the tenants, we, we train them and then we certify them to show that they've been trained and they understand what we do. We expect the manager then to pass that training down the line to their own employees. They know what we expect. The, the difference here between here and many of the other centres is that if, we, if it doesn't come down segregated, we send it back. We can't be doing the work for them and it's small bits at a time. They can easily do it where for us, with 35 tonnes every week or, or, or more, it's a bigger job for us. So if they do their little bit, it all makes a huge difference down here.